my name is Jamie Brown and uh, I'm an illustrator and today I'm going to be trying to create an image uh, of a kinetic moving ball. Nice. Hopefully it'll play with the eyes a bit and uh, give the effect of a speeding, speeding ball. My name is Craig Ward and I'm a designer and illustrator. I am hoping to kind of convey the importance of the, the crowd in, uh, in football and how much of an effect they can have, especially when you're playing at home, kind of the 12th man effect. Just from a personal point of view, designers tend to be very skinny, non-physical people. And just to get us to interpret the football, the game, very physical thing, uh, it's just you know, it's going to be interesting to see what people come up with. The O is, is kind of building up to a big, ooh, you know, the, the crowd noise when you miss the goal. Um, and also people's mouths, you know, when you're shouting. It, it's just quite a, it's a very football-y shape isn't it it just felt right i hope so i hope it's going to have the energy and you know getting people involved a little bit later on it'll just bring that random aspect to it as well well i guess football to me is about it's about excitement it's about energy and it's about movement this project's been really fun it's a good it's a good chance to bring two passions together it really stretches you because a lot of people it's their passion they love football it's a million miles away from kind of where I normally work. I work a lot with um, letterpress at home, but it's on a, a much smaller scale. I kind of work away on a little, I don't know, 8x5 and a couple of trays of type. Uh, it's just completely different to see it up large. I mean, this is only really one step up from potato printing, but it's, it's just really fun just to see it you know, scaled up. Uh, I do a lot of physical stuff, um, a lot of stuff kind of big on walls, uh, kind of outside and occasionally in shops and stuff. Um, I do the odd live event, this is a little bit new for me. I work always generally in flat colour, um, so this is in keeping with that. And um, this is actually quite new to me, I've never specifically made something purely out of dots, but I'm just trying to play with this kinetic idea. I think it went pretty good. I enjoyed it. Everyone seemed to enjoy it. And it's turned out, yeah, it's turned out quite fun. It's more or less how I envisioned it. Yeah, everyone's been really chirpy and um, generally, yeah, up for it. It's not too far off where I kind of had it in my head. But that was the idea of opening up to, you know, passers-by and, and getting friends to come down and, and help out. So I, I think it's worked out okay. What's on the canvas? Well, we're um, we're celebrating the crowd and uh, their importance in the game. So that was the thought behind getting people involved. Uh, we're celebrating the shape and, and the energy in football as well. So uh, the texture as well, like quite by accident, is it just feels like we've belted a football against a wall for an hour or so, which is which is awesome because that was like one of the first thoughts. They're kind of quite similar and they work very well together. Yeah. They kind of bounce off each other. It's a happy accident, actually. I'm glad the colours are, are different, you know, two teams. Mm. And, uh, there's, different, there's, there's a similarity in shape and there's a lot of texture going on. There is, actually. There's a common... I don't know how you'll see it develop over the rest of the project, but you know, maybe I'm sure spheres will get used a lot, but it's just nice to for two to sit together so nicely. That's right? awesome. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Alex. Well done, man. Yeah.